Corel Painter 2022 includes many enhancements that were requested by the Painter community. I'm really excited to see a live grayscale preview included in the Navigator panel. You can enable and disable this from the top right menu in the panel or make a custom shortcut button. Previewing your artwork in grayscale is important because it can sometimes be difficult to tell how light or dark a color is. Viewing only the light and dark colors can help you correctly balance the value contrast in your painting. If I shift the value of just this one background element, it throws off the realism of the whole landscape. There have been many enhancements to the Layers panel. You can spotlight the visibility of layers with Alt-click or Option-click on Mac, load a mask from a selection, clear the contents of a layer with Delete, perform actions on more than one layer, collapse visible layers, and there are even two new composite methods, Color Dodge and Color Burn, which can also be used as merge modes with glazing brushes to give a more natural looking color blend. You can make a selection and move it with the Layer Adjuster tool, and the selected pixels will move in tandem with the selection. In Painter 2022, when you lock layers, it's recorded in the undo steps. Multiple layers can now be moved at once in the Layers panel. Just select the layers you want to move and drag them to rearrange the order. In the event that you select a brush that is not compatible with the layer type you're painting on, an enhanced layer compatibility dialog appears, offering you options for how to proceed. If you like, you can permanently apply your preference. These dialogs will also appear if you select a brush that may look different when used on a special layer type, and for instances where you are painting with a brush that should be used with the gel composite method.